Cal State Fullerton takes a four-game losing streak into their home match against Columbia. Assistant coach Diego Bocanegra tweeted after their last game, can someone please remove the invisible shield in front of the goal? We are inches away from an offensive explosion. They lost to LMU 1-0 after outshooting them 19-3. That invisible shield comes into play in the set piece in the first half. Kishi Smith crosses the ball in the box. Lillian Klein stops the shot. Caitlin Milano is there for the rebound, but just can't find the back of the net. Game remains tied. Later in the second half, Erica Mazzo finds Rebecca Wilson. She's in the box and rips the shot, but Klein again comes up big, and the game is tied at zero. Under a minute left in the second overtime, and Wilson, surrounded by four defenders, squeaks the ball to Kishi Smith, who puts the ball in the game away. It took Smith a school record 12 shots to break that invisible shield, and it pays off as the Titans beat Columbia 1-0. We didn't find it a few times, but got 12 shots, so I mean, and I know everyone on the team backed me up with those shots. I mean, we probably outshot them a lot, so um, with taking shots comes a goal. If I need to take 12 shots to get a goal every game, I'll do that. I mean. The golden goal by Kishi Smith improves Cal State Fullerton 2-4-1 of the season. This victory is the first overtime win this year. From Titan Stadium, Ashley Correa, Titan Sports Recap.